What is up, beautiful people, and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing my second holiday gift guide video for you guys today, just to show you guys some more of my holiday ideas of what you should, guys should get for yourself or for other people. If you guys did not see my first video, holiday gift guide is my little thing that I'm doing, like a little series before Christmas that I'm going to show you guys my favorite things or things that are great to buy for the holidays. Great stocking stuffers, great palettes, everything like that. I'm going to be doing a tutorial to show you guys how they work. So pretty much I'm just going to show you guys some things that I think you should get for other people or for yourself for this Christmas season. So first off, we're going to use the Saharan palette by Juvia's Place. We're going to be putting on a Lime Crime lip. We're going to be using an Anastasia Glow Kit and of course using a Tarte Blush palette. So if you guys want to see the lowdown and what items I used today, then keep on watching. My base and concealer is on, but now we don't have any blush, bronzer, or highlighter on. So first thing we're going to go in is with the Tarte Blush Bliss Blush Palette. This one is exclusively at Ulta, and it is a really nice little holiday gift, especially if you like blushes or if you know anyone who likes blushes. So I need to warm up this face because my face looks like just Casper the Friendly Ghost right now. So I'm going to take this shade right here, which is called Grateful. bronze, I'm going to use my all-time favorite Hoola Bronzer by Benefit. This one is actually a really great stocking stuffer for anyone who wants to get someone a nice bronzer. I personally just love, love, love this thing. I love it to contour, I love it to bronze up my face, I love it for everything. Next up we are going to highlight. So this is one of those highlighting palettes that is just a really good holy grail for anybody and it's still available in stock. This is Anastasia Glow Kit in Sun Dipped. I'm actually going to be using this shade right here which is called Moonstone. And now to add a little bit more I'm going to go in with Summer. We're done with the face, it is time for the eyes. Today I'm going to be using a really well talked about internet crazed brand, but mostly because their palettes are so affordable and the pigmentation is amazing. This is the Saharan palette by Juvia's Place. You're going to get some amazingly bright and bold shadows in here and some neutrals as well. I cannot wait to play with this eyeshadow palette. The one thing is I will say, I am sorry if I butcher the name of any of these. So, the first shade we're going to go in with is... Katsina? Katsina? I'm gonna say that. I hope I said that right. We're gonna go in this shade right here in the crease. I know I want this look to be very, very bold. I'm gonna go in with this shade right here, which is pronounced Sokoto. Sokoto. Before I finish my crease, I'm actually going to go in with my lid color. I know, shocking, right? I'm going to go in with this really gorgeous shade right here, which is actually pronounced Wadabi. Now it is time for some crease action here. I'm actually going to do a like, kind of dramatic halo eye. Probably, maybe. I'm gonna go in with this bottom kind of grayish black shade, which is called Chad. Oh. 
for my brow bone and inner corner highlight, I'm actually going to go in with this. I'm going to go in with this shade right here. I think it's called Iman. Again, I greatly apologize about the lighting for some odd reason. Every five seconds, the lighting just keeps going out on me. So, for the under part of my eye, my lower lash line, I'm going to go back in with Chad and Sokoto. Sokoto? hope that I'm still pronouncing that right. And then I will probably just end it with that. Okay, so now that the eyes are completely done, I'm going to throw on some lashes and I'll be right back to throw on a lip. The eyes are completely done and now it's time to throw on a lip. I'm going to go in with a new lipstick that I just got and that is the Lime Crime Blue Flame Velveteen Lipstick. Now definitely this is a much bolder side to Christmas time, but honestly, I absolutely love the way that this look came out just because it's very, very, very dramatic. So anyways, before I go, I just want to give you a recap. I think that these are some great holiday additions to throw in stockings or just to wrap up and put under the Christmas tree or to buy for yourself. The Tarte Blush Palette is actually one of my new favorite blush palettes. The formula is really nice, they blend really nicely, and the pigmentation is there. It's the same formula hopefully, as the Amazonian clay blushes that they have before. The Anastasia Glow Kit is really nice for anyone on your Christmas list. It's just a simple, go-to, easy Christmas gift for anybody who is a makeup addict. Next up, I would have to say the Hula Bronzer and the Blue Flame Lipstick. This one's a little bit more bold, but honestly, any Lime Crime lipstick is actually really nice because they are very nice. They don't really dry out my lips, which is really nice. They're $20. They are now available at Ulta.com, so it's another really good plus. And also the Hula Bronzers are a really nice addition to the stocking. So, little stocking stuff for us here and there. And then last but not least, the Saharan Palette by Juvia's Place. This one is only available on JuviusPlace.com, but it is such a great palette. I absolutely love the pigmentation of these. That's the Saharan palette was actually really, really nice. I actually thought that the palette was actually very immaculate. The pigmentation was really nice. The formula was really nice. I just felt like this palette just definitely took the cake on that one. Um, I purchased this for $18. I mean, I know that they always have a sale. I think it's like $23 right now, but that's still not a really bad price point. That is the end of this holiday gift guide part two, and I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Again, make sure you thumbs it up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the very, very near future. Love you. Bye.